Hello everyone, welcome to a brand new video. Today's video is going to be quite different than pretty much any video you've ever seen on this channel. Um, today we're just going to be talking about my productivity desk setup for 2023. This has been requested a few times during my study live streams and I thought that since we're not streaming this weekend that I would try to get a video out for you guys on my setup. So we're just going to go over the setup, maybe some behind the scenes um, things that you don't see during the live stream and just kind of um, the productivity flow and um, how I've intentionally designed my setup. So let's get into it. So probably what a lot of people are curious about is what's actually behind all of this stuff. So if I zoom out here a little bit, you can see I have this bookshelf here over to my left. I have kind of more of my self developing books. I have some binders of cards and then kind of um, programming related books and then literature books manga I've, I've played trombone in my life so i actually own two trombones believe it or not kind of cool maybe one day we'll do a cover <laughs> i think that would be funny um i also have a keyboard trying to learn the piano uh comment down below if you know what that song is over here just kind of have two places for storage i have storage in this dresser here and storage in this uh, container bit here. And on top of that, my iPad, um, which I don't I don't use too much um, anymore, but I occasionally use this for drawing out stuff or trying to solve um, other problems and whatnot. But uh, this is the iPad Air uh, 3. I also have the Apple Pencil, and then the case is the Logitech Combo Touch, probably the best um, the best case that I found for iPads, at least in my opinion. I like the detachable um, keyboard, which you obviously don't see. Um, it's actually over there. I'm going to this other side. I'm sure many of you are probably familiar with this. Um, this is kind of the stream, the Discord, um, the Discord screen. I actually took the uh, the mount that was on it off. It actually does not fall if I just lean it up against the wall here. Um, so uh, if this video comes out on time, um, the first people that will be able to see this are the ones that watch the video. Whiteboard stuff um, for my whiteboard, obviously. Um, I have a fake plant, fake plant number one. Um, and then I have this really nice handmade wood block of my logo created from created by one of my friends i don't know if she'll watch the video but now we get into kind of the good stuff and i'll just do a little pan around here to just show you a lot of you have probably never seen this bit of the setup before so we'll go into um this to start this is the stream setup and so basically when I'm streaming on uh, YouTube, doing my study live streams, this is the computer that's streaming from. Um, this is also the computer that I do more of my Windows uh, software development stuff on if I'm testing on Windows or if I'm running a program. So for instance, this is currently running a Discord bot right now. If you're curious um, about that, um, go check out my Discord server down in the description. Um, it's essentially a study bot where you can uh, track time and do some other fun stuff <laughs> about that. I just have some more programming books over here that I've been um, reading chapters here and there from time to time. Um, I have this shelf with, um, this is the mouse that I use to uh, change scenes with when I have it over on the actual, um, actual <laughs> setup um i then i just have some other knickknacks i have a usb uh that's like a usb hub there and then a usb stick for peripherals uh this setup has a razor this is a razor naga trinity mouse uh this is a razor black widow chroma uh keyboard with the wrist rest i really like the wrist rest that's kind of why i use it over here um and then i just 
uh, this is actually really new, um, but I have a numpad over here whenever I do numpad-y things, right? <laughs> and I have a sound bar here that just connects through USB, um, kind of convenient and very easy to have sound. Um, I'm not really too much of a guy that has really crazy speakers or anything. These do just fine for me. This displays 27 inches, connects through HDMI to the computer. Um, it's, it's really nice. Um, there's a there's a, an interesting thing going on there. Um, but uh, other than that, it uh, works uh, really, really well. I have, this is my uh, book stand. I have my Kindle on here, which is my e-reader. Um, I have a piece of paper for me ready to take whatever notes I'm trying to take. And then I have my uh, stationary setup over here. And then I have some other stuff like scissors or, you know, that kind of stuff. We have the computer itself. This is the stream computer. Hello there. I don't know you can't see because the, the panel's on here, but as a Ryzen 5 2600, it has 16 gigabytes of Corsair uh, RAM at 3200 megahertz. That probably means nothing to anyone watching. It has a GTX 1650 Super, 500 gig SSD. <laughs> Maybe someone cares about what I'm talking about. And then the cameras, you might be interested about the cameras because I stream. Um, I have this one, which looks like it just got out of place. It's it, it's it's kind of scuffed, but this is the, the sitting down angle. And then recently I've moved this one to the standing up angle. None of these are like expensive cameras or anything. This one was like maybe 20 bucks and then this one is maybe like 50 bucks. But yeah, that's kind of the uh, the the area that no one sees during the streams. But yeah, this is what it's looked like. And if I have pictures, I'll throw pictures up right now of what this area actually looked like before. This area has definitely changed um, a lot over the years, just like the um, other side of the setup, which I will... Um, which I will go into now. Before I go into, I guess, the details, there's actually not a lot to talk about. I'll just talk about what's on the wall. So I have my degree up on the wall, and then I have this cool uh, mindset poster that I got. And then up here, I just have some programming related stuff. Most of it's C and C++ things that I don't even code in on a regular basis, but hey, it's cool. And I, I don't know, I've had it on the wall forever. <laughs> yeah, let's move on to the, to the, to the setup that everyone else sees. Um, this has also evolved plenty of times over the years. And if I didn't put uh, pictures up at the beginning, they'll probably be up right now of what this looked like. Um, at some point, but this is what it looks like right now. Um, pretty minimal. This is actually a sit stand desk, hence why I have that two cameras, right? Basically, um, what we got going on here is essentially my version of how I am intentional with my workspace. So, um, as we see, I have a light back here. This gives me light, that's kind of its purpose. I have essential oil diffuser. I like them, I think they're calming and good. Um, but yeah, then I have this nice mouse mat, which is actually like a newer addition to um, this setup. I really like extended mouse mats. Yeah, this one's really nice. It has a nice, um, of. this is like a, like a Japanese wave. I think it has a real name. If I have that name, I'll throw it up. I have a coaster. I actually have two coasters here. Um, so when I have a drink or a coffee, I'll, I'll have coasters and I try to have both I try to have my water always on, so if I have a coffee, I'll use both of the coasters. And they're kind of getting really dirty because I keep spilling my coffee. But moving on back here, I have fake plant number two. And then I have this headphone stand along with my noise canceling headphones. These are Soundcore Life Tune something. I think there's a number in there too. I really have no idea. I have my microphone. This is my blue snowball. I've had this thing forever. Um, and then it's attached to a mic arm. Very, very cool stuff. I have some LED lights going on. These are GoV light strips. But yeah, as you can see, I have a, I have a MacBook. This is the M1 Pro MacBook um, Pro. <laughs> is that is that right? But yeah, this uh, I picked this up back in December. I always wanted to try a Mac, and I fell absolutely in love with it. 
Um, I don't have like a, a cool USB hub setup or anything. I just have the charger and then my uh, the HDMI port, which is which was the selling point of this Mac for me was the single HDMI port. So I could hook it up to my 24 inch Samsung monitor, which is on a monitor arm and you can't see any wires under it except for this light this light switch which powers my um my light bar right there very cool um obviously there are still wires and i'm i'm not really someone that cares a whole lot about cables but you know uh it's there i think the only thing i haven't really talked about is i have another web camera up here that's connected to the monitor that i can use i typically just use the one that's on my uh macbook though um for the time being <laughs> the last thing um the mouse that i use is the logitech mx master 2s and i've also had this thing for quite a long time things that i typically do at this setup i will typically um code that's pretty much like the primary thing that i do um especially during the streams i code and i take notes on some course or, or some youtube video that i'm trying to learn new things on and all I'll, I'll typically slide this over to the left hand side i'll put my mouse kind of generally over here and then i'll move uh, my book stand over here to take notes but yeah i mean that pretty much it's pre pretty much it for people who don't know um i stream study with me live every saturday and sunday um i try to do around seven to ten hours every every saturday and i typically do seven to eight hours on sunday um but weeks vary there's not really any set time but i typically will always do it on those days um so if that's something that interests you um feel free to come 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 study you know what i'm saying so um but yeah that's going to be it of this video if you guys like more content like this i was considering making more um give me feedback on what you think i can improve but yeah with that being said if you made it this far you were here and see you next time tomo study is a um new it's not new